I never thought I'd see it with my own eyes. The first PSB 10,000. This is where it all started. Thanks to its built-in regenerative electronic load and its ability to recover energy at 96% efficiency. The tests it performs now will lead to generations of new batteries that power the electronic vehicles of my future. I beg your pardon, good citizen. What the? Who are you? Just a fellow admirer of the PSB 10,000, but I don't think you understand the full impact. You see, the PSB 10,000's bi-directional capabilities, which allow it to source and sync power at will, allowed engineers from my timeline to develop renewable energy solutions that power my utopian society. You're both incorrect. It's the superior design with silicon carbide that enables the power density of multiple PSB 10,000s to output up to two megawatts of power that is most impressive. The ability to develop and test with that much energy eventually enabled the creation of advanced fuel cells that power cybernetic organisms like me. No way. It's the ease of use that matters most. The PSB 10,000's touch controls are so user-friendly that engineers in my timeline use it to create a whole new reality. It's coming with me. I'm afraid I don't agree. That is not a logical conclusion. Not happening. Hey there! I hate to break this up, but if all of your respective futures came to be because of the PSP 10,000, doesn't the PSP 10,000 already exist in your future? I mean, why come all the way back here, right? Couldn't you just jump to an ever so slightly later point when your timelines have already diverged? There'd still be an original PSB 10,000 for each of you, and there'd be no need to get messy. Or am I missing something about the fundamental aspects of time travel? Hmm? Whatever. I'm afraid it's not that simple, friend. Error. Whoa! Oh! So I guess I'll clean this up then? The PSB 10,000 from EA Electroautomatic, powering renewable energy solutions for a better future. Or futures, I guess.